Hey guys, I wanted to show you a few more books that I like to use. This is my second attempt at making this video. It's very windy today and just had a big gust of wind come by and uh, blow my books. So we shall try this again. These books are only $3 a piece. This one is very fine. This is a really good book to use this time of year when all the berries are showing up. And they break it down like Newcomb's Guide. All these books do. They break it down into little keys to help you to um, easily identify the plants. I absolutely love ferns. I just find them so magical. Um, they are just such a great plant. In the winter, you'll find um, seed pods on the plants. So this winter weed finder will help you to identify it by looking at the seeds and the pods. And it's a really good book. Also in the winter time, um, it's sometimes hard to um, identify trees that have lost their leaves, the deciduous trees. I mean, pine trees are different. But um, this book shows you what the bark looks like and the buds. Um, what location it might be in and you know the color of the bark so this is a really really great book this book would have come in handy the other day life on the intertidal rocks when I saw that little um, crab down in Nantasket oh gosh it comes the wind again I love the wind though I really do so anyways this is another flower finder book little book easy to use and tree finder this one comes in handy when the leaves are on the trees shows you the shape of the leaf and, um, again where the location is and um, tells you the, what color to look out for and uh, the pattern so this is a great book this one I use year round I mean a lot of times people think oh track Tracking animals is just a winter thing, that you're looking in the snow, but you can find plenty of tracks along the edge of a river or a pond. Even in my backyard on a rainy day, I'll see tracks by my bird feeder. So this um, shows you the animal and the region that they might be in and, and the shape, the shape of their tracks and when they're walking, what it will look like. So these little books, like I said, are only $3. They're very small. They can fit right in my fanny pack. You see, all these books don't take up that much room. And obviously, you're not going to be bringing all of them on every walk. Um, you're going to bring up the ones that um, are for that season. My goal next year is to um, really work on the ferns. I know some of them, but that's just something I really want to get into is identifying the ferns. They're just both busy eating seeds. Black cap chickadee just landed on my bird bath, which I need to fill. Okay, little chickadee, I'll fill that up in a minute. Have a very good day, everybody.